Let me show you how I made this simple curtain holders for your room. First I went to the Dollar Tree and I found this mason jar lid with a uh, wire, dollar a piece. I bought two and you can either cut the chain off or you can leave it on. I chose to leave it on. I bought these flowers there as well for a dollar. So overall the project was three dollars. I cut one off as you'll see here and I put this war wire floral wiring underneath to hold it better but it didn't work as well with the E6000. So I ended up taking that out and I ended up getting my hot glue gun out and what a difference. So the, the hot glue gun definitely worked over the E6000 for this. Then I set them where I wanted them and just held them really tight for a while and made my two. Like I said, I left the chains on just to see and I actually liked what I did. I used little tiny hooks in the back that are like the command strips. I'm going to get better hooks eventually, but that's what I did for now just to give you a demonstration. This is my guest room that I'm trying to fix up a little bit. This candle right here, I did a DIY video on how I made that um, to accent as well if you want to see it. Um, there's my curtain holders with my little hooks. And uh, I really like it. I'm going to get better hooks, like I said. But this cut candle right here, I got this jar from Goodwill for 99 cents. And I upcycled an old candle and poured it into that so I could decorate the room. So I'll link the video to that below so you can see how I did that. But I hope you like it. And please subscribe for more DIYs for around your house.